how are we doing today? This morning I woke up pretty early and just kind of had a relaxing morning, which I haven't had in a while. Actually really liking this whole like little brown moment, you know? And the brows, let me get into the brows. Hold on, let me order my Starbucks. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? In the foam? Yes, please. Give me one sec. And then I'm sorry, you wanted oat milk instead of coconut milk? Yes, please. Okay. Anything else? Nope, that was it. Alrighty, that's Grande, right? Yes. 634, you can pull up. Alright, thank you so much. The Starbucks people are so nice here. Like, I love them. They're always so friendly and so nice. So let me know if you guys like how my brows look today. I'm kind of digging it. They're a little messy, to be honest, because this brow is having a moment. It just like does not want to work with me lately. But um, I use the NYX brow pen and I'm actually like really obsessed with how they look. Like they look really natural. I just flicked in the little like fake hairs that needed to be put into my brows, I guess. I don't know. So yeah, I was actually thinking of going to the mall today. Um, and I just wanted to shop for myself a little bit, try to see if I could find a few things. Um, I haven't really been out by myself like that in a minute. Like I've just been home a lot and I feel like when I do that, I tend to just box myself up and not really associate with a lot of people. And I hate when I get like that because I'm a very social person, if you know me. So I just thought going out, seeing people, saying hi to people, talking to people <laughs> might help. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you? 634. Yep. Do you want a straw for this? If I could, please. Yeah, Thank you. I like your nails. Thank you. So pretty. Thank you. Give me one sec. All right, you're all set. Thank you. Have a nice Thank day. Thank you. You too. Thank you. They're so nice. I know it's customer service. I know it's what they're supposed to do, but I feel like some of them are just very, like, genuinely happy and genuinely super nice, and I love it. So good. I can breathe. I feel like I was sweating in there. It's literally, I was only in there for a little bit. It's 2.09, okay. It's 2.09 now, and I think I went in there around one, maybe a little earlier than that. So not too bad. I feel like I was in Forever 21 for a very long time, but it was so hard to vlog in there because I literally felt like there was like an associate following me everywhere I went. And I was like, okay, I'm not gonna do this. Like, she's probably gonna tell me not to film in here. But I did get some stuff from Forever, which I will show you guys when I get home. I'm gonna do a poll right now on Instagram to see if anybody wants to see like a little try on haul. And then I also got Ulta. Obviously, you guys saw, I saw the brow glue and I had to get it because I was at Target yesterday and they didn't have it. Then they gave me a little gift to go with it and I don't want to show you guys yet. Stay tuned. She was like, I'm just going to give you this just because. And I was like, okay, sure. I'll take anything free. I'm getting a little like hungry, but I'm not really hungry. And I kind of want some Mickey D's. Yeah, I kind of want some fries. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the gym later, right? Logic. <laughs> so, almost just dropped my fries. Love that. I got a large fry, which I never really do, but there was like this coupon for like a dollar off. Oh, I just got a notification, sorry. <laughs> for a dollar off on these, and I was like, is that just, you know, God telling me to get the large fry? <laughs> I don't really eat out like this, to be honest. Like, I used to eat out a lot, like a lot. It was so bad. But like lately, I just like don't even crave it. It's just like, I don't know. I, I'd i rather just make food at home. But don't get me wrong. I love my Chick-fil-A and I love my McDonald's and like my Chipotle, which I haven't had in a minute. I can't open this. I'm trying to open my honey mustard. Oh my God. I feel like if I have them plain, it's just like, why? <laughs> why did I get you? I haven't had fries in a minute. Let's see how this lipstick holds up. I'm really digging this combination. This might be my everyday. If you guys have seen any of my makeup tutorials, I think in one of them I did say 
and that I don't have any lip liners. Like I literally lost them all. I don't know where they went. And I used to have so many. I don't know where they went. And on top of that, I went to Target yesterday and I bought three lip liners. The third one is nowhere to be found. It's on the receipt. I did buy it. I did put it in the bag. I just, this is literally what happens to me. I wanted to do that. Um, I was talking to my brother about it, my sister. Order what the person in front of you ordered. Do a drive through I was debating between doing, ordering what the person in front of me ordered or doing the employee. Please don't park next to me. <laughs> Out of all the parking spots here, they always pick me. Me, always. Anyways, I was debating whether doing the person in front of me or having employees pick what I eat. I didn't know which one to do. I could do both, but which one should I do first? I feel like that'd be fun to do. And they're like, by where I live, there are so many fast food places. So many. I think that'd be a fun video. I also want to do like a sit down mukbang with you guys. Which I don't know how that would work because I hate eating on camera, but doing it now so is anybody pumped for the summer because literally that whole week that we had with the nice ass weather got me so freaking excited like so excited and then it went back to like 40 degree weather but i was pumped i went out and took pictures and i was like oh my god i'm so ready i've been going to the gym eating healthy eating healthy <laughs> Like, I'm ready. But then Jersey has to play me like that. You guys see that little... <laughs> the little piece? I fried that off. Not my sister. I can't blame my sister. But she was doing my bangs. And she was bleaching them. Customer came in. And she told me, watch them. And then rinse. I was so busy trying to post for my mom's salon and like trying to get content for her Instagram because I've been trying to help her with that and trying to make sure that her business grows because she's worked really hard to get where she's at, like really hard. But I just got so wrapped into doing that, rinsed it, get home, and I'm noticing the rest of my hair, perfect because she did it right right whatever i touch mm -mm. nope <laughs> so i'm blow drying it and then what do i see little pieces just breaking off now any normal girl would probably be freaking out and sad and upset or whatever you know because i don't know girls in their hair tell me why i just continued blow drying it after i saw them fall out i've been doing crap to my hair since i was 13 I, I've seen it all. I don't even care anymore. I feel like it just grows back anyways. It's fine. It was my fault anyway. What am I going to do? I can't go back and glue my hair on. But. You know, the first time I dyed my hair, I wish I had a picture. I wish I had a picture. The first time I dyed my hair. I was attractive. I think I dyed it blue and green. Because it was the first time that my mom said yes to highlights. And what did I choose? Blue and green. It was blue and green or blue and red. I thought it was so cool. So cool. There was nothing cool about that. Like, I look back and, like, I can see myself. And I'm like, holy crap, that was not cute. Someone should have stopped me. I want to do fun stuff with my hair, though. I was talking to my sister about it. Like, I've always wanted to do, like, a fun color. It's not easy to, um, to do that kind of stuff. For offices like that, it's just not ideal. I might just get a wig. Mmm! Actually, to be honest, I also wanted to do a video on, um, honey mustard on my finger. Who has the napkins? Actually finishing these fries. Okay. You get it, girl. I was actually going to do a video. I don't know if you guys would be interested in this, but in ordering wigs off of Amazon and trying them out. Because, girl, do I have a full cart of wigs. 
shout out to Raquel if you're seeing this I will order a red wig just for you because <laughs> I remember I dyed my hair red at one point like cat from Victorious red my girl was obsessed with that color every time I asked her what color I should do in my hair it was always red go back to red so I will personally get a red wig for you and wear it when I go see you yeah give me a heads up what you all think also i would love for you guys i don't know if this is annoying for me to ask but you guys please like it doesn't have to be like comments in the videos or anything like that even though i would love that <laughs> but can you guys just let me know like what you guys want to see from me i don't know i just want to know what you guys like want to see from me like do you guys enjoy the makeup videos do you guys enjoy vlogs more do you guys want to see challenges let me know because whatever it is i'll film it i got you but yeah there's a haul coming soon i know i keep saying that in every freaking video and i'm so sorry but like i said a few videos ago i'm being very picky with what i order when i'm telling you i'm trying to buy things that i know i will wear for sure not things that are going to end up at the bottom of my closet so i'm going to place the order i'm going to look at it one more time but i'm going to place the order then i'm going to give my bank account a break because i got to do some repairs on my car dead ass have you guys ever seen that movie shopaholic where i'm not a shopaholic like that i used to be but you guys know the scene in that movie when like she freezes i think she freezes her credit cards or one of her credit cards and she puts it in the freezer and like in the middle of an ice cube and she has to break the ice cube to get her card out i need to do that with my card i'm thinking i'm thinking tj mac wouldn't hurt right wouldn't hurt my sister's like she's coming over around four and tj max is like right around the corner from my house so i can always just like meet up with her i'm debating should i go I should go right i feel like this is where i'm telling you my my, my debit card should be freezed freezed because <laughs> i don't know i just want to kill some time and like i said i haven't really been out by myself like this so yeah i think i'm gonna go with tj maxx i think the little voice in my head has won and i think we're just gonna head over there and see what there is too much in there just a tiny little baggie now i'm gonna do the poll on insta because i was gonna do it before but then <laughs> but then i realized that i was going somewhere else all right i'm back <laughs> um my sister texted me that she's actually heading over now she's bringing over i think her pup which is the most beautiful puppy i gotta show you when, when i meet up with her because this is like the most beautiful puppy i've ever seen in my entire life it's a pit bull and um, she's so freaking cute i told her i'm like right now i'm not ready for another dog just because yeah it's just not no cute. so i think they're coming now she wants to see how she's gonna interact with bubby um with Jax. i keep saying bubby on here i guess you guys know by now but so once my sister came over, we actually went to go get some fruit bowls, which was delicious. And then we ended up playing on the Nintendo Switches and also then introduced Bubby to Nova, which is my sister's pup. He was not having it. Then we had the puppies play outside and it was just so cute to see them run around and just having so much fun. I was so obsessed with both of them. And I think I'm going to end the vlog out here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you. And stay tuned for that try on haul. It will be coming very, very soon. And please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below. As well as turn on your post notifications for that next video. Love you guys. Let's make